Hello, Lori Papau here. Today I'm going to talk about different vinyl coatings for your eggs, as well as three methods to apply them. Here you can see the various varnishes and protective finishes one can use on our eggs. Some people like to use an epoxy. This one comes out thicker, but it produces a beautiful shine. Here are various polyurethane varnishes. Although these are relatively inexpensive and very easy to find, one downside is that over time they will produce a yellow cast to the white parts on the egg. This one is great for producing a crystal clear, very strong finish. But you have to be careful with this because it dries very quickly and is almost impossible to get off your fingers. The Golden product is very nice for many reasons, but most especially since it is a removable varnish. If you should make a mistake, you can take it off with some mineral spirits. Also, if the product gets thick over time, you can add some mineral spirits to thin it out a bit. I've had this can for about 10 years already, and the product is still good today as it was back when I first opened it. This is a great product that is UV resistant. What that means is when applied after you remove all the wax from your egg, it forms a protective barrier over your egg to keep out ultraviolet rays. UV rays come from both sunlight and in some cases indoor light bulbs. UV rays are known to fade dyes so lightly spraying some of this coating on your egg can help prevent fading of the dye colors in your designs when the egg is exposed to light throughout the years. If you want to use this UV coating, you would spray it on your egg, let the UV coating dry, and then afterwards you can, if you want, apply a final coating of polyurethane. Next, I'm going to show you how to roll the egg. This time, I'm just going to dip my fingers in the varnish and just smear it all over the egg. This is how we dip the egg. And after most of the varnish has drained off, we then put it on a stand I've taken a ball of styrofoam, covered it with um, foil just so that I can reuse this styrofoam stand over and over. Otherwise the varnish would eat up the uh, styrofoam. Okay, another method is pouring. So we would hold our egg over a bowl and of course we would put gloves on 
and then we would pour our varnish over the egg. And we pour a lot over the egg and just let it drip down. And again, we use our little styrofoam ball or whatever you have set up. Some people use sand. I used to use sand uh, in a container. But then I found sometimes that the sand got on my hands and then on my finished work. So I found that this is a little bit better method. I hope this video has helped you with showing several ways to varnish your eggs.